Morning, everybody. Um, this is Sandy Monroe again, looking at the, uh, the Tesla Model 3 um, over here. I wanted just to let you know that what we've seen so far is that the, uh, uh, the Tesla Model 3 and the, and the Model Y have similar suspension systems, but it's obvious they're not the same. A couple of little notes that we've seen, none of these parts are the same. One thing we did notice is that over here on the damper, Instead of having these uh, bands, they've decided to put in uh, a couple of screws. And we'll show you that over here um, at, the, uh, at the car itself. If we look up here, uh, let's let everybody get over. If you look way up at the top here, um, you'll, see, you'll see right up here uh, that there's two screws now uh, holding in the damper. That was one of the things we noticed. Then you'll see that the uh, the uh, lower control arms are much beefier than, uh, than what you saw in the past. Uh, it's a, let, a slightly different configuration, not that much different, but when we get into it, we'll be able to tell a little more about how this is working. So let's kind of like take a quick look here back at the uh, rear suspension. <clears throat> you'll, see that, um, you'll see that it looks very, very similar and uh, even more similar when you start to look right here and you see that this has got a lower control arm here that says Model 3 right on it. So we're looking at good commonality. This is a good idea for, uh, for car makers to use or reuse parts that, uh, that have uh, proven to be uh, worthwhile. We also see that this is offset uh, still. Uh, other car companies have uh, put them in line, but uh, the half shafts here are offset, which is similar to what, uh, what uh, Tesla did in the past. So we haven't gotten a chance to really get into uh, too much uh, big detail, but, uh, but now, that I've got, uh, now that I've got a couple of the uh, uh, pass-by panels off, uh, it's starting to look, uh, we can start to see now what's gonna be more interesting and, and, uh, and what's different and what's common. Now, there's one thing that I do have to clear up. <coughs> uh, I made a mistake, I guess. I uh, kept calling this the uh, the, uh, the dual motor version, it's not. This is the performance version. Uh, and uh, I'd like to thank everybody. Everybody that corrected me on that, I appreciate it. And we'll get back to you as soon as we possibly can with uh, more on the Tesla Model Y teardown. Thank you for tuning in.